Hey, what's going on, Mark? My name's Kyle. I just wanted to reach out and make you a video that can bring you and your business some value. In this video, I'm going to go over some tips and tricks on things you can do to help optimize your website so you can drive in more traffic and generate more leads for your business. So I do have three tips I want to share. First tip is the importance of content and keywords. Now, Google doesn't care about how awesome websites look. They care about what kind of content's on a page. Google likes to see a lot of content. In the, in the websites that have the most content, they're going to be the ones with the authority on that topic. That's why I recommend that you have at least 1,500 words of content inside in your home page. Now, another really big reason that you have that much content on your home page is because you need to have buyer intent keywords inside your content. So when Google goes through and scans to your page, page, they can find these keywords and then they can rank you accordingly on Google. And on top of that, the more content you have on your page, the more keywords you can put inside your content. Now, we use this tool here called Arefs and one of the buys data from Google and it allows us to search buyer intent keywords. So I just looked up electrician Vancouver and these are just some examples of keywords you can put inside your content. The electrician Vancouver, that's being searched 600 times a month. You have residential electrician Vancouver WA. I mean, you have all sorts of different types of keywords you can put in there. Electrical contractor Vancouver, that's being searched 90 times a month. You have companies, company repairs, your, your switch installations. So there's all sorts of buyer intent keywords that you can put inside your content that you can be found for. There's keywords for all of your services that you provide, and there's buyer intent keywords for all your service areas as well. So it's very important to have them in there. One last thing you can do with these keywords is making sure that your pictures are saved properly. Right now, when Google goes through your page, they see this picture saved as download. Instead, I would have it saved as just-in-time electric, you know, residential electrician of Vancouver. You know, because you want your branding. Branding is very important. And you also want to have a keyword in there as well so you can be found for that. Now, my second tip for you is backlinks. Backlinks are just as important as content and keywords. It's what gives your website power, and it's what drives it up to the top of the Google search engine. The backlink is their links throughout the web that, when clicked on, will bring the user back to your website. It's, it's almost like having a popularity contest, and the person with the most backlinks wins. However, Google is now leaning more towards quality versus quantity. Google wants to see backlinks that are relevant to you. So they want to see these backlinks coming from other electrical websites or home improvement websites that have links linking people back to your website. Now, ARIS also allows us to see what's going on behind the scenes of, of websites. And I do want to mention there are free tools that you can use. If you Google backlink checker or keyword finder, you can find the free tools you need to be able to get this done yourself. So now you have a URL rating of 23, that's how powerful the site is. A domain rating of 0.8, that's how trustworthy the website is. And you have over 230 people coming onto your website through an organic search each month, which is pretty good. That's not bad at all. And you also have 109 keywords that you're being found for. And you have 66 referring domains, giving you a total of 391 backlinks. Now these backlinks here is what gives your website power and the trust flow. And you actually want these two numbers as close together as possible. And you want them as high as possible. You want to shoot for a ratio of one. One is being meaning that you are a very trustworthy website. Now I just pulled up the Google search bar and I just looked up electrician uh, in Vancouver. And this is Perry Electric. They're in the number one spot. And as you can see, this company... They have tons of content on their home page. You know, content's king. When you put content on your page, be very thorough with what it is exactly that you do. You know, get down to the details. It's important. Now, I looked up their website, and they have a URL rating of 35, a domain rating of 25. And these two numbers here tell me immediately that they are putting on good quality backlinks to their website. They have over 3,300 people coming onto their website each month through an organic search. Which is that's that's tons of traffic. They're generating tons of lead for their business. They have almost five thousand keywords that they're being found for. They have eight hundred and eighty-seven referring domains, giving them a total of two thousand seven hundred and seventy backlinks. Now, if these backlinks here are good enough to rank their website to the top, 
it's good enough to do the same for yours as long as you have your content and keywords in order. And you can do this with all of your top competitors. You can get all the top competitors' backlinks and link them back to you. You just go to their referring domains. And each and every one of these websites here has a link linking people back to their website. And you can do the same thing with yours. You just go into each individual site. Some you just might have to create a profile and you can add your website that way. Others you might have to go to the contact us, email the owner, and they might hit you back with a small fee to be able to advertise on their website. Now my last tip for you is get to this number one spot in the Google Map Pack. I mean, it's one of the best spots to be in. 40% of the traffic or 40% of the searches that are searched on Google go to the Google Map Pack. So this area has tons of tons of traffic. So how do you get to this top spot here? You need more citations than them. All a citation is is your business name, your business address, and your business phone number listed in directories throughout the web. Some examples of a directory would be places like Yelp, White Pages, Yellow Pages, Better Business Bureau. They're even considering social media a directory nowadays. So, Mark, I, I do hope this, this short video was helpful for you. You know, just a quick recap. You can take over your service areas by putting, you know, 1,500 words, even 2,000 words of content. The more, the better. The more content you have, the more buyer intent keywords you can, you can add into the content, more ways you can be found for it. Then get all the backlinks all of your top competitors have. Get them linking back to you. And finally, keep adding your business name, your business address, and your business phone number listed in more directories than your competition has all across the Internet. Now, again, I do hope this video is helpful. If you have any questions, you're more than welcome to reach out. Uh, other than that, you have an awesome day. Thank you.